Hi everyone, thanks again for joining me. My name is Yannick Dagle and we're here to unbox another game. Today we're unboxing Cryptid. This game is published by Osprey Games and let's have a look inside. Now, shameless plug for the Dice Tower team that they did give this a seal of a excellence, not even of approval, but excellence, so gold star. And uh, they don't do it often, but uh, it will be exciting to see what's inside. Now, and part of the reason why I bought this game. Um, again, Tom Vassell and team, little Z, if they give it a gold star, it's definitely worth taking a peek at. And based off the theme of this game, if I can open up the lid, I, uh, it really interested me in being able to um, get this game. Oh my gosh, now, I will tell you, not the easiest game to open, as you can see. Okay, slide video, so this what happens. Sometimes you just can't get it open. There we go, okay. Um, actually, so before just opening, I should have flipped it around, and you'll see here that it's really for ages 10 plus. Uh, should be 30 to 50 minutes to play, three to five players, and is a versus game. So, uh, again here, first thing that we see is the user manual. And, very colorful. Font's not too small, so should be easy to read. This is a little bit small, so I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but that's always a good indicator to sort of indicate um, small font. Now, it's not critical, I don't think, because it's more of a uh, description, but uh, it could be difficult to see. Um, again, instructions, taking a peek throughout. Looks more focused on a lot of text, and then possible clues, things to be able to try to find, and again, a quick re reference rule set, which is great to see. Shameless promotion from the publisher in regards to some of their other games. I'll still flash it because uh, it always helps them. And again, here you've got personal player aids, which is great. Now these are not cardboard, or that initial one was not cardboard. And, um, sorry, it is a book, so, or two-pager, I should say. So it's not cardboard, um, so not super sturdy, um, but I would think still serves its purpose. Some people might want to laminate it. Um, I know I would consider it right now just because nothing is worse than having cheesies all over the place. But then again, not sure if that would interfere with the uh, gameplay. So, again... It's one for each player, which is great. So that's still very, very good that they put that in there. Um, punch boards. This is to make the uh, map or the island, however you want to call it. You can also encrypt it on the other side. And... So really add some customization in there. Then you've got the scenario decks, or setup decks, if I recall. This is more of being able to where you're supposed to hide. Again, I've never played this game. Uh, they are standard card size, so it looks to be uh, same, same cards as you would for um, what looks to appear to be uh, Magic the Gathering, for example. So standard size. Get that out of the way. But I don't think this will spoil anything to show a few examples of these. And then the backs of the cards will show some of the setup um, scenarios for each player. And then now within this big baggie, And here we've got the various pieces, so orange cubes, light blue cubes, purple cubes, uh, red cubes, teal cubes. I think that's all the cubes. Then you've got these uh, cylinder pieces, triangle pieces, and there's the uh, a token or what I would call a token wise a, a robber. Uh, but I'm not sure what it's called here in this game. And then discs in the color for each uh, player as well. 
And the purples. So these are all solid wood. They're not plastic, so it's great. And then that's everything inside. So that was cryptid. Um, unboxed. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, put them down below. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe. We'll continue to do some more unboxing. I thank you very much for watching. Again, my name is Yannick Degg, and we'll see you next time. Have yourself a great day, and make it an awesome one. Bye for now.